Hello again, it's Vicki with Condi Systems Technical Support. I'm here in Photoshop CS6 and in this demonstration I'm going to show you how to use the digital downloads we have on Condi webpage, condi.com. Click on anything in the menu up at the top, sublimation for instance, and over to the left you'll find the digital downloads. Also you'll find it on our product page. On our product page, Mug 15, the stockings, some of the um, uh, other digital downloads that you could use in, in coordinates with this video would work all the same in Photoshop and any other versions of Photoshop as it, they're very similar in how we click on the layer and place the image. So I have Mug 15 as a demonstration and I've opened up the uh, templates. So this is going to show how to use Condi templates with the background digital downloads with Photoshop. So using the Condi templates, bringing in the digital download background so you can place and manipulate and create a, uh, a mug or whatever it is that you want to place on your on your mug in this demonstration. But the background digital downloads, using them in the Condi templates in Photoshop, that's what we want to show here. So I have Mug 15 template open and I'm ready to uh, demonstrate how we go about getting an image on this background layer uh, particularly the digital downloads. Okay, so as with Photoshop, everything works in layers. So in the templates that I make here at Condi, I always put the top layer is always going to be the actual keyhole, the template, what you're going to look through to see your image. And your image is going to be behind this keyhole. So keep in mind, anything on top is what this white area is. And what's behind here is a transparent layer where you can place your image size it and print it and what you see come through this area here is what would be sublimated onto your mug. So again, when you're working in Photoshop you want to click on the layer in which you want your image to be placed on and we want the image to be behind this area so we can see what's going to be printed and transferred. So clicking on place your image or graphic here selects that layer and now we're ready to go get the digital download that I have selected for this demonstration. So you, once you download your uh, digital downloads from Condi web page and you save them, then you, you're ready to go and get them from that place where you saved them. So I've done that. I've created, I've downloaded and created a folder. I'm going to click File, Place, and that I'll go find the folder. And my folder is the digital downloads video for this demonstration and I have my background digital download here. So I'm going to select that. It's Mug 15 Pack 2 PSD because we're in Photoshop. We want to choose the Photoshop layer. Once I've selected it, I can click Place and that brings it up behind this layer here. You can see. And remember, anything behind is always under. And while it's still X and boxed, you can see the nodes here. This gives me the opportunity opportunity to size and place. So I'm going to shift it over just by holding my left click down, selecting in an area, holding it down. And now I'm going to grab one of the corners and we always want to grab a corner so that it will uh, equally proportion as we size. So we're going to fit it in this box as tight as we can without going outside the area too much. Once we do that, we're ready to uh, we're ready to double click somewhere within this area and get rid of the X, which places the image permanently in there. So again, there I have my uh, background ready to work with. What I want to do uh, with this mug template at this point is really up to you. Uh, placing the background in is as simple as just what I've shown you. So if you have any questions, feel free to give me a call. My name is Vicki Condi Systems, and this demonstration has been about using background digital downloads in Photoshop. And if you feel free to give us a call, anyone in this department can help you. Thank you for your time.